Hello and welcome back to uh, Joy being trapped in a one by one little hut. Uh, so I um, sat here for a while in stealth. Um, I don't remember how long. It's been a few hours. I had to eat. I had to eat a few of my uh, berries. Um, so uh, and I've just been crouched, just chilling. Like, like I fast forwarded time to find out. So, um, I, I don't have a fancy plan. <laughs> there's, there's two ideas here. One, open the door, sprint like hell. Uh, one, open the door. Maybe one zombie comes in or two leap over the wall and hope for the best. Um, I'm going to go with leap over the wall. Here's why, uh, the banging noise, they're trying to break my wall and it's coming out of my right headphone. So I think, I think they're over here. Now, I could be wrong. I'm literally flipping a coin. Here, I'll show you, or I'll I'll let you hear. Um, yeah, I hear banging out of my right. So, um, I am going to leap this wall right here. Hope for the best. Ugh! Oh, we're super fine. Oh boy! Oh goodness. This is exactly what happened on my other fishing hut. Apparently fishing attracts a lot of zombies. They don't like you fishing, man. You think they would would like you fishing? Because that would mean that they that you are um getting fat. And and you're all you're all fattened up for the zombies. Lots of lots of uh meat. They'd rather eat a fat, a fat person than a skinny person, right? Okay. Um, I really didn't get a lot of fishing done. <laughs> Not as much as I wanted to. That's irritating. Stop it! hear I still hear one it's from the right somewhere there it is there's actually one down below as well <sighs> what did we even get we got a trout a big carpy yeah two friggin fish man Do I, I, I'm sitting here thinking, uh, if you're wondering why I'm in silence, I am debating fishing again and, uh, attracting even more zombies. There's one up there. It looks like this whole pond is the fishing. When I was on the river, I was able to shift myself down a few feet and the abundance would go back up. Can we get one more? One behind me. No, I 
guess there's not one behind me. I thought there was. Oh, here they come. They this the noise of spearfishing is pretty extreme. Look, here comes another horde. They do not like you fishing, man. Fishing's bad. You thought shouting was bad. It's actually fishing. There are some behind me. I'll try to pan my camera back a little bit. I'm in a bad way. I'm in a pretty bad situation. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit more confident now. Um Yeah, they don't they don't uh yeah, I've been I spent a lot of time not talking here. Uh, <laughs> I'm I'm trying to think, trying not to get myself in trouble, but this fishing is wild, right? Like I uh, I'm not I'm not going crazy here, right? Like you guys are seeing this? Like my god. There are more zombies here than when I uh, shout. And this is the situation that happened to me uh, over at my other fishing shack. you kind of starting to see the corpses build up. Ugh. Come on. That downward stab is going to get me freaking killed. Or maybe this is the perfect time to get better at it. Definitely one behind me. Yeah, okay. They're still coming. They're still coming. Where are they coming from? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. They're coming from the east. Apparently there's uh, eight bajillion zombies just uh, hanging out in the woods because, you know, that's where they like to hang out. I don't get it. If you get it, let me know. They're still coming. Still coming. Still coming. <laughs> still coming. Oh. oh, I lost it. Oh, I lost it. And there's a zombie here. I was going to try to loot the... Uh, I was going to try to loot the uh, watches. Only The only thing I can think of... In these situations is that the homes to the south are like empty ish because where in the world are all these friggin zombies coming from right like they gotta be coming from over there like this is so many zombies i can't see them i can show you on the map though right like is this is this close enough to be pulling from these these homes here? Uh, we need to add a fish. Where's the fish? Fish. Make it a little smaller. Fish. Ah. <sighs> Broccoli seeds. Okay. I don't know. I don't. I don't really know what's going on. Yeah, I uh, spent a lot of time not talking there because I was. I was getting nervous. Didn't really know what the correct decision was. Oh, well, we're not dead. Three planks. Um, something funky going on with the fishing in the ponds. Uh, I don't know what it is. Um, but the abundance is not going up. Uh, it, it has been many days and the abundance of this pond has not gone up. Now the mechanics of fishing, uh, I'm not, I guess I'm not super up on. 
but I was under the impression that uh, the abundance, because when I when I was on Lester, I basically fished in the same spot. But he had that large river, right? Ooh, there's a zombie. Come on, discard. I should kill him. I don't know why I'm walking away. Where'd he go? Oh, pull it up. Okay, there was a, zo there was a zombie. There was something up here. Discard. We'll keep our hunger gauge up this way, but we're not going to be gaining any weight. In fact, we'll probably be losing weight at some point here. Oof. Oof. Keep it in the trees. I bet my I bet my clothing is damaged. I spent so much time. I'm not using the walk command. Uh if you can right click and use the walk to command, and your character will avoid all obstacles and trees and stuff. I haven't been using it. Uh I'm always afraid I'll walk into a zombie or something stupid. So, I don't feel like I accomplished anything other than almost dying. Why does it always feel like I, I never... It always feels like I'm never accomplishing anything. It always feels like I'm just, like, finding new and more clever ways to kill myself. I got some fish. <laughs> our, and our... And to be fair, our... Um, Weight isn't going down. Uh, issue on that pond, though. I'll need to look that up, but that pond, if that does not grow in fishermen, so this one is this one is zero. I couldn't fish in that one. I didn't check this one. These two we can fish in, but this one they have not been going up, and it's been like uh, a, a pretty significant amount of time. <sighs> I've been thinking about how I was, when I ended that last episode, I thought I would be clever and create a, uh, create a, uh, like they do in TV shows, always leave it on a cliffhanger, right? Well, then I sat here, there's those socks I was looking for. I sat here thinking about this <laughs> the whole time. It was like, oh, I got to load up the game and I'm going to have to go through gonna have to try to get joy out of that situation and it's just not gonna work i'm calling it now this is where joy dies oh but she didn't die this away okay so i'm going to need this and this um and i need to light this bad boy light it up oh, she did it right away look at that okay great stir fry uh, from fish, I guess. Uh, cilantro. Oh, we have cilantro. Is this spice? I didn't even know I picked that up. Cool. Put it in there. Oh, look at that. Soup. Thistle, cilantro, fish. Should I do that? Create stew, create soup. Add thistle. I don't... Thistle seems so weird. I feel like I'm going to... Herbs, soup. Play... Three is, yeah, so three is where we start to lose. Okay, speed up time, we're cooking. So this is cooked, eat that bad boy. Oh, 
Oh, that was a huge chunk of calories. Oh my lord. Drink all. Oh my lord. Oh, wow. That thing jumped from like... Wow, that was... Apparently cooking is a good thing. Or I've grossly underestimated it or something. I don't know, because I, I was used to eating the cooked fish, and it would give it would give you chunks. But that's the most I've seen all in one like one go. There. Um, I need a duct tape. God, I need so much. You know, I spent so much time thinking about what the heck. Like, is she going? Oh, this is. Don't do that. That one. I didn't realize that one was uh, already repaired once. I spent so much time thinking about uh, over the days that Joy, how am I going to get her out of the situation that I didn't actually come up with a plan on what I'm going to do during the episode. So I don't know what I'm, I don't know what I'm up to. Uh, yeah, I didn't, I didn't think of anything. Um, I guess we... We can go back to, uh, we can go back to the construction area and try to find more nails or we can clear out the, cause we do need nails, but we can clear out the homes and look for some food or some canned goods or books. Kind of continue down on that route. We need to do a little bit of everything, though. I would feel a little bit more comfortable if I was, uh, not... So I had an onion. Oh, I should have sliced the onion. I didn't realize... Oh, that's my mistake. I didn't realize it needed to be sliced first. Oh, damn. I'm kind of upset I did that. The uh, box is full. And this box is also full. That's great. That's just great. <laughs> okay, so, uh... Ugh. Okay. So the soup was, like, super good. That soup was amazing. And that was a fish plus uh, a seasoning of... What was it? Cilantro or something? Um... Thing is, I just don't... Oh, I wanted to check. I keep running into stuff. I'm going to check my clothing. Because I keep... I keep, like, walking through trees and stuff. And sometimes you can damage your stuff when you do that. Okay, it doesn't look like anything's damaged. That's good. Ugh. God, this was stressful. I've been thinking about this day. Playing Joy. I'm not doing that again. Leaving on a cliffhanger like that. That was awful. That was awful for me. Where am I? It's so dark I can't see anything. Here, I was gonna give, I was gonna attempt to grab these stupid boxes over here. Thirty percent chance to break. Okay. Uh, we got it. Wow, look at us. We're amazing. Dis dismantle. Perfect. And let's try to pick this one up. Nice. We got both. Hell yeah. Ooh, we are fat, though. Oh, we're fat. We're so fat. I'll just throw down the ground. How fast are the calories going down? Uh, they're not, really. Slowly. Huh. Weird. I thought it was based on your carry weight, but I guess I was wrong. The last time I looked when I was walking around, it was flying down, but... Now it's not. That soup, that soup did wonders, man. Oh my gosh. Okay, so, um, 
How in the heck are we going to do this? You can't... I could just... drop all this on the ground, I guess. Oof. Oh. Oh, what do I do? I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed I'm in this situation. Okay, idea. <sighs> okay, okay. Equip in both hands. If it's equipped, it doesn't affect your weight. Alright, I want to try... Okay. Now, now that's busted open, so let's place this back on the table. Uh, and I guess I'll just put the crates down here. I don't know. Place item. Crate. Crate. Okay. So that... That is 60 K weight there. Um, I need... I, I, well, I guess that's one thing I could do. This is going to be a super boring episode now that I left you on a cliffhanger. Uh, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to organize. Um, and we should bring probably weapons. Let's do weapons. So shotgun shells, ammo. Uh, we'll bring all this stuff. Uh, the military pants should be on my coat rack. I don't know why they're in here. Spoon is technically a weapon. Baseball bat. Crowbar. The crowbar is a weapon, but I don't use it as a weapon. I'm using it to unlock uh, doors and stuff. Okay. So let's weapons. Yeah, let's weapons in a crate because weapons are generally kind of heavy, so uh, I feel like it's going to take up uh, quite a bit of room. So, because this container is 60, whereas the shelf is only 50, and I feel like I will fill the shelf faster than I fill uh, faster than I fill a crate. It's 10 more. <laughs> it's not much, but it's 10 more. Okay, so um, the other box should have Oh, the pistol. I didn't put the pistol away. The other box should have, um, the shotgun in it. Barry. Okay. All the way at the bottom of one of these. I had to separate... This is not organized at all. I had to separate all this stuff because... Uh, there just wasn't enough room. These these little like crate boxes are only 25 carry weight. It's just not enough. Uh, is that it for weapons? You know what? If we already had a welder mask. I didn't even realize that. But I think that's it for weapons. Oh no, bread knives, bread knives, bread knives. I see them now. Uh, scissors, not a weapon. Can be used as a weapon. Pipe wrench, not a weapon. Can be used as a weapon. Propane torch. Nails. So we've got 25 nails. Um, eight. 25 and eight. Uh, I was thinking we might be able to actually plumb in a sink. Okay, so bread knives. Shotgun is in here. Excellent. Uh, so the sledge and the axe. I think we'll just leave here, maybe. So then that leaves, uh, 
So weapons are done. Oh no, baseball bat is not done. I need to put baseball bat away. This is where I wanted to put the kitchen, but now I'm filling it with this stuff. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. So now let's grab. Let's grab. Uh, let's say crafting stuffs. It's, I know that's not very descriptive, but that's how I describe it in my head. Crafting stuff. Like all this junk, like scissors. I guess not lighter and matches, but like adhesive tape, screws, sparklers, hinges, duct tape, all like all this junk. You know, all that stuff. All that goes in my generalized crafting box that I always have in every base. Kind of a bit like a junk drawer, honestly. Nails. A uh, propane torch and a welding mask will likely go in there as well. Okay, let's go down. I'll put that in the shelf, probably. Because this doesn't normally get that heavy. Light bulb. Scissors. Okay. 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 Uh, let's go down to here. I guess I, I always think it's obvious to me, but maybe it's not obvious to someone who may, maybe is newer to the game. But when you're when you're managing your inventory in here. Um, this works just like on the computer, if you were to select multiple things, like if I hold control and click on another item, um, I can select multiple items. Just like if you were doing uh, something else on the computer with text or something, or files, but I, if you hold shift, you'll select all in between. Uh, probably everybody knows that, so... I'm 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 speaking to myself, I guess, but hey, maybe there's maybe there's one person or something that didn't know, and uh, hopefully they now know. So we'll need a cooking box. I will put these in here, and the mask. If I have another character that dies, he'll have some stuff, I guess. Uh, so I'm I'm actually running. I might leave these as is. I didn't know you could walk through these boxes. Isn't that weird? Is that a bug? Is that a bug? Hmm. What did I do with the pipe bridge? Is that in here? Or did I put that in the weapon box? Did I not even touch it? Wrench, grab it. I might need to move those crates. I'm thinking, just sort of thinking to myself here. Um, I think the easiest one to empty is this one, and so I will dump all of this in my bag. Uh, actually, it looks like I would need to dump both, because one will be in the air if I don't. So maybe what I'll do is now I'll shift everything to the other box, and I will pick up that one. There we go. Large cardboard box. Place. Uh, I might, I, I kind of want to put it out here. Because what I was thinking was making this the, uh, like, we'll put our seeds and stuff in here. So it, the game treats this as being under, under, like, no rain. 
Because my tomatoes don't get watered in here. So I'm going to put, I might need to water those tomatoes. So I am going to put uh, seeds in here. Uh, yeah. Now this box is like cooking stuffs, I guess. Uh, oh, I did pick up a flag, but I can't put it anywhere. So I guess I don't know what to do with it. Guess I'll just leave it in the box. What's oh, heavy? I didn't realize it was that heavy. Okay, um, and I can throw this welder mask away because I have got, I've got another one that I didn't know I had. I've got a propane tank as well, so we can do a little bit of metalworking if we want to. We're level 10 short blade. I guess I didn't see when that happened. Uh, I have got my wrench so I'm gonna go get one of those sinks um, and I'm thinking maybe we'll work on that try to expand this area a little bit we never did level up our carpentry so that sort of hampers what I wanted to do um, I think I can still do it and what I'll do is just move move some of these shelving and crates and stuff. Okay. So there's a muffin tray here. Uh, I think you can literally make muffins if you have, like, the stuff. Chance to break 25. It broke. <laughs> Go us. It broke. So this is chance to break 30. Did not break. Very freaking heavy though. Can I drop this? No. Well shit. I gotta take it back. Can I put it in my backpack? Nope. Can I put it in primary? Yes. Okay, we got a little bit of our weight back. So I'll need to go find another sink, because I busted that one. I busted it so bad that I obliterated it, and there's nothing left of it. Uh, that is how good of a plumber Joy is. We destroyed it. Absolutely annihilated it. <laughs> Don't know where the pieces went. But yeah, what I, what I wanted to do, I guess I didn't speak about it, uh, or did I in the video? I can't remember. I was thinking of making this area down here a kitchen, uh, stove, and freezers. Um, and the freezers won't fit with the shelving in here, but I think what I'll do is, if I can get everything set up, uh, I will just move, I'll just move the, uh, uh, the shelving and stuff, right? Like, not a big deal. Where is this thing? Uh, unequip. Okay. Place item. So it needs to be here. No, 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 no. It needs to be out there. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, oh, damn. Can I put this in a box? Okay, perfect. So the uh, sink needs to be directly below a rain collector. And you pipe from that to there. I was thinking I would do it on the overhang here, uh, but since I can't, all this stuff is sort of in the way. Literally everything is just sort of in the way. Uh, 
If I do that crate, I won't be able to build. I could move the crate and just put put two of them up there. Because the door is here. But I could block this spot and this spot. Let's do that. Pick this cardboard box up. Uh, we'll just we'll just place this guy down here. I think next to uh, next to the barbecue. Oh no, sacks! Uh, sacks go over here. That is, I use that for fertilizer. If we ever make a compost thing, don't know if we ever will. Nope, keep that. Those go in there. Any dif oh, I guess I don't have a box for uh, first aid. That's okay. I'm gonna keep one painkiller on me. Tweezers, uh, beer can, flour, ketchup. That goes in there. Uh, red wine, white wine, yeast, star, and flag. Mouse trap and empty bowls. Is that everything? Roughly? I think so. How many uh, planks are here? Just one. Okay. Grab the axe. Uh, definitely. Uh, a reason I try to do some of this stuff off camera because this is all like um I, I feel like this is boring. I don't know if people are interested in this, but this is sort of what ends up happening off camera. I just kinda organize and shuffle things around. Is that her hair? Oh yeah, I think that is her hair. So let's saw some logs. Alright, and furniture, furniture, carpentry, furniture. This one requires four planks, four nails. So let's grab four. One. Grab one. Come on, come on, work with me here. And then last one. Alright, and then I need to go... Grab nails from the box. Or, no, the shelf. Nails. Okay. And we will build a ring collector up here. Carpentry, furniture. Oh, I didn't pick up garbage bags. Uh, here. So I'm gonna build two. Um, my understanding is that they work in tandem. Uh, so if you have one next to another one, it should fill the other one. Perfect. So half. Alright, we'll build the other one here. Um, and there's no overhang on this side, so it, these should fill. Carpentry, furniture, ring collector barrel. Okay. Alright. Nope. And I can still walk through these. I don't know if that's a bug or what. Can I walk through these other barrels? Can I walk through this? No. It must be a bug being up on that walkway. I can't walk through any of this stuff. Okay, so this needs to be moved again. And then we pick this guy up. Sink will go there. Um, I guess I'll need to place this... I don't know. We'll just place it right here. This will need a better spot. It, whenever I can, like, build, like, legitimately build, we'll make this look nice, but we just can't right now. 
I need I need too much stuff. Um, I need the sledge. Sledgehammer. Um, and I'm going to destroy these back walls. Destroy. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Now, grab this. Place this here. Um, and when we have more planks, we will wall off behind it so it doesn't look so silly. And then, um, now I need to go get, so let's put the, place the axe, place the sledge. Uh, oh, I need to put this stuff away. Keep the pipe wrench. This needs to be put away. Okay. And then let's go get another, let's go get another, uh, sink. Or at least attempt to. Um, there's a few sinks. Uh, those those steel sinks are I don't know if they are visually different if there are visually different sinks like there are visually different fridges and stuff but um, I know that there is for sure one more of those uh, steel looking sinks so I'll try to get that one if it breaks oh well wasn't meant to be I guess uh, there's tons of shelving over here we have got two shelves here there's three more shelves and another tent up there. There's two more shelves here. And there's there's so much shelving. Um, and I'll bring it all over as soon as we have, like, space to do it, I guess. So I want to say it's in here. Yeah. This one. Oh, there's a bucket. Um, I might take the bucket with me. So pick up. Sink. 25%. Okay, so industrial sink. So hopefully it doesn't break. Got it. Uh, because this, it's, it says specifically industrial, which leads me to believe that it is in fact different than, uh, the regular looking sinks. But I'm thinking that, uh, we really should clear out the construction site to get more nails because we're really, we're really getting into a position now, right? Where... Like, I know food is a little, it's a little touch and go, but we haven't, like, full-blown starved. And we're getting into a situation where we really want to, like, expand the base and make the base look kind of nice. Uh, and I can't do that without nails. I can come through here and dismantle everything I see, but it's just, it doesn't give you, it doesn't give you the uh, amount of nails that I need. I can do some of it, but not all of it. How do you do this? Oh, I, I have it equipped. That's right. Unequip it. Unequip. Okay. And then I'm assuming you just place it. Place. Nice. Okay. Okay, that's done. Now. Uh. Do you do it from here or up there? Oh, that's right. It has to be enclosed in a room. So this won't work until... Uh, this won't work until we can enclose it. So that means, in fact, that this... We need to take the sledge and destroy all of these metal walls. And this whole thing needs to be enclosed in wood. Uh, and it needs to be considered a room. Which means I need nails. Uh, so... Uh, put this pipe wrench uh, in here. We're not hungry. We're gonna eat a violet, I guess. The generator. How are we doing? Seventy-nine percent, ninety-six percent condition. It's dropping. It's dropping. Dropping pretty fast. That's okay. That's alright. Bound to happen, right? Uh. Oh. Let's. Okay, I'm gonna. Let's go back real quick. And, uh, double check. 
double check our equipment. Uh, okay, boxes of screws and paper clips, uh, nails, 25. That's not nearly enough. Um, if I can count these out. Um, yeah, so. One, two, three, four, eight. Nine, ten, eleven. And then a door. So that's uh, 20, 22, 44 nails, and then 52 nails altogether, because I think the, I think the door, yeah, the door is eight. So we need 52 nails altogether to enclose the whole thing. Uh, we also would need... I believe we'll also need, uh, where? Pillar. Which is three nails. What did I say? 52? 9, 12, 60, 64 nails altogether, I think, to uh, tear down that wall and put up a, wall, a wood one. I might be able to get that from dismantling. And I wouldn't have to adventure, especially since I've wasted so much time in the episode and we're at uh, 15 minutes left already. Huh. There's a zombie there. How is there a zombie there? There's one here, too. They aren't decomposing? I mean, they, sh they should have decomposed long, long ago. There's one here, too. Weird. That's weird. Let's check out the sink. What does it say the sink is? Chrome sink. So they are, in fact, different. Uh, did I need to do electrical? No, I've still got the modifier up. Okay, so I can I can safely disassemble this radio. Disassemble mini fridge requires... Uh, so that's metalworking. Um, that is a nice stove. Which I can pick up. Well, I might just do that. Okay, we're gonna go back with the stove. Gray oven. Oh lord, I'm heavy. Uh, equip in the primary. You know what? I'm gonna equip that in my secondary, and we're gonna one hand carry this whole oven all the way back to base. Yeah, I think this will work out all right. Just a lot of running back and forth. A lot we need to... There's a lot we need to do. You know, I think I... Didn't I pick up a bucket? I did. Let's place that over here. Okay. Now this stove... Let me just think about this, um, because of the way things are placed, uh, <laughs> I want to say it's going to be right where one of the tomato plants are, <laughs> which is, uh, unfortunate, because I could have, if we do stove to the left, water to the right, the water cooler. That leaves a double, a double here, which is obviously a freezer, a double here, which is another freezer, and then we have empty spots here. Yeah. 
Uh, I was able to put the sink in here. Can I put the oven in here? Perfect. So I don't have to place it. That's perfect. Okay. Uh, cause I was, I was considering just digging up the tomato plant, but I kind of want the food. And this stuff, uh, disassemble. Nothing. Or do you get something? Uh, skills. Carpentry, we are at uh, 54613. Here we go. 546. Nope, you get something. All right. Um, and nails. Huh. Curious. Can't disassemble these chairs, but you can disassemble these tables, which give you wood. Isn't that interesting? Isn't that interesting? Who'd have thought? I had no idea. Come on, disassemble. Get to work. What do you think you're doing? We need nails, man. We need... I already forget the number I came up with. Six, 64, I think I said. 64 nails. That's a lot of disassembling. There is a way I can get rid of these chairs more easily. Um, I can edit them out. Rather than having to dispose of them one by one. Which I might do. I might not do. It's not something high on my list. But I, I have a feeling the garden is just going to sort of expand that way, so... Uh, oh, we got all this junk on us. Uh, I'm just going to drop this on the ground. So, 40 nails. That's actually quite a few. I didn't expect to have so many so soon. So this, I'm assuming, is carpentry. And this is... also carpentry? Also carpentry. Alright, and then these need to be empty before I can dismantle. That's why I thought it required a propane torch. It's the dismantle function that requires the propane torch. Yeah. Bed. Has items in it. Disassemble. Okay. Uh, six nails on the ground. Headphones. Dismantle the headphones. Perfect. Throw that junk on the ground. We're up to 46 nails. Um, I will need to... Ooh, there's a radio. Um, there's a value tech porter disc. Dismantle. And then also dismantle. Got three light bulbs, not too shabby. Oh, it's both. Interesting. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, except we didn't get any nails out of the deal. Nails. Nails. Oh, that was okay, I guess. Um, and these are... Can I dismantle the computer? Yes. What do we need? What do we need a computer for? Propane torch. Uh, dis I have a ham radio. Okay. Give me them nails. Nails. Uh, and more nails. Perfect. Excellent. 
We are up to 60. Oh, wow. We're actually really close. Huh. I didn't think it would be that easy. Could have done this a lot sooner, honestly. Oh, I didn't realize I was hungry still. Uh, I got this thistle. It's kind of weird. Eating thistle like that. Here's a table. Got two nails out of the deal. Uh, that puts us a... What did I say? 64? I think that's enough. I'm at 65. Unless I'm miscounted, which is a uh, pretty good chance, I would say, of me mis miscounting. Um, I'm going to build this. And uh, that, it's going to put us, I think it's going to put us over the hour mark. I don't want a green light bulb. I'm going to do it anyways. I'm going to build it anyways. Can I disassemble those though with those shelving there? Or is this going to be a pain in my butt? Is the question. I bet I can't. I bet I can't disassemble that stuff. Unless these, these are empty. Um, okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to grab the sludge. And, because this is going to take longer than the four minutes I have left in the video. And I'm going to bust down this framework, move all this stuff, and I am going to cut down some trees, and then I am going to build the walls and the pillars and put the stove in and uh, pipe up the uh, sink, and I will do all of that in the span of uh, like five seconds. So don't blink. Did you blink? This was awful to do. Uh... Boy, did I run into some serious issues. This took uh, that day plus the next day, 11.40 a.m. I'm also very hungry, um, out of food, but the sink is plumbed. I ran into an issue where the room wasn't considered a room, so I had to cut down extra trees, go get some more nails to build this staircase because I thought I would add in, I would make the room one bigger uh, which uh, meant that I didn't have enough nails. It also meant that I had to add a roof, so I had to put in a staircase to get up to the roof uh, in order to build the floors. And then I ran into an issue with the pillars, where the pillars didn't make the room a room, so I had to take the pillars out, put the pillar in the southeast section. It works now. Um, this is plumbed, ready to go. Uh, the stove works. Um, stuff is a little bit organized. I lost one of my... Rain collectors, when I picked it up, it broke. I also lost a crate. My crate broke when I picked it up. Uh, yeah. I think off camera, I will spend some time organizing this, making this look a little bit better. Uh, but, uh, I guess this is, this is it. This is the kitchen slash warehouse. Uh, I'm going to bring in some more shelving and stuff and, uh, you know, uh, maybe some more crates. Uh, but yeah, um, I appreciate you for watching this madness. Uh, that is me attempting to play Project Zomboid, um, and I will see you in the next episode.